In today's episode, Elon Musk claims the world's most powerful computer, Tesla wants to make candy, police want to drive Teslas, and the Cybertruck goes viral. The world's most powerful AI training cluster was launched this Monday by Elon Musk and his teams from XAI, Apex.com, NVIDIA, and supporting companies. Ironically, this Memphis supercluster started training around 4.20 a.m. local time. What makes this cluster the most powerful in the world? It has 100,000 liquid-cooled NVIDIA H100S in a single RDMA fabric. RDMA stands for Remote Direct Memory Access, allowing multiple computers connected by Ethernet to share data in a low-latency environment. The H100S are a high-performance variant of NVIDIA's GPU, optimized for AI training. In simple terms, AI training involves running trillions of calculations with different variables until the computer does what you want. The more parallel calculations you can run, the faster your computer will reach the final answer. Before we continue, I'd like to ask for a moment of your time. If you're enjoying this content and want to stay up to date with the latest tech news, please consider subscribing to the channel. Your subscription helps us continue to bring you updated information and in-depth analysis. Now, let's get back to the topic. Many XAI employees shared how incredible their journey was in building this system, dubbed the Computing Gigafactory. In a recent interview, Musk said this new cluster took only 19 days to set up. The CEO of Supermicro, one of the supporting companies mentioned by Elon, praised Musk's leadership in liquid cooling technology for large AI centers, stating that it could lead to the preservation of 20 billion trees for our planet. Toby Poland, a founding member of XAI, claims the company now has three advantages, data, talent, and computing power. Musk says they're still looking to increase human talent at XAI, Tesla, and X. What will the world's most powerful AI training cluster be used for? We know that one of the outcomes will be XAI's Grok 3. Musk sees Grok expanding to much more than just another language model, becoming a kind of generalized AI brain. In other news, Tesla surprisingly wants to make candy. The company registered four new trademarks for different types of candy, supercharged gummies, cyberberry, mango bolt, and dog mode chill. This idea goes back to a Musk tweet in 2018, in response to a comment by Warren Buffett about competitive advantages in the candy market. In the field of public safety, Standard Fleet is collaborating with Unplugged Performance's Upfit division to optimize electric police car management. The South Pasadena police will be the first in the U.S. to adopt a fully electric fleet. Lastly, Tesla's Cybertruck is gaining massive exposure in virtual worlds. Online gaming platforms Fortnite and Rocket League both from Epic Games, introduced the Cybertruck into their virtual universes this week. This will provide significant free publicity for the vehicle, potentially reaching millions of new eyes. These news items demonstrate the accelerated pace of technological innovation and how companies like Tesla and XAI are redefining multiple sectors. XAI's supercomputer represents a significant advance in processing capacity for AI, but also raises questions about energy consumption and environmental impact. Tesla's entry into the candy market is a surprising move that shows the company's versatility. The adoption of electric vehicles by the police marks an important step in the transition to more sustainable transportation. It's fascinating to observe how these innovations are shaping our future, but it's crucial to maintain a critical eye on their long-term impacts.